As Columbus's 60th anniversary comes to an end, so does Brother Kevin Handeboat's tenure as president. After a rigorous vetting process, the Columbus Board of Directors decided Mr. Thomas Kruchek was the right man for the job. So in the world of education, um, I was the dean of a business school. Um, I ran a couple of centers for entrepreneurship, and currently I'm the president of Notre Dame College, which is located in Cleveland, Ohio. I think, you know, from what, you know, Brother Kevin has done, he's just done a magnificent job of leading the school into, into the future. And my role will be to continue on his legacy and continue to move forward and continue to drive, you know, Columbus forward to, to the next level. And this lasting legacy is what Mr. Kruchek hopes to continue as he becomes the new president of Columbus. What we really want to continue to do is the, the strong legacy of all the things that happen here, from the, love, the service that, you, that the students do, the, the work that you do in the academics, the work that you do in performing arts and STEM, all of those kinds of things that make you, again, such outstanding young men. That's what I want to continue to do. Coming to Columbus all the way from Cleveland, Ohio, has its challenges. But Mr. Kruchek is more than willing to put in the work to truly understand the Columbus community. So for me right now, it really is, is thinking about getting to know the school, you know, getting to know the culture of the school, getting to know the tradition and the history of the school, you know, meeting the faculty, meeting the staff, meeting students, which has been, you know, it's been a lot of fun to be able to do that today, and then reaching out and meeting the alumni. I think, you know, that's really the most important thing, and spending time with the board as well. I think that really is, is my first step. Before I think of anything else, it's not, a, you know, I don't want to get ahead of my skis here. It really is a matter of getting to know the school, um, and that's why, you know, spending time here today while the students are still here is such an important piece for me to be able to take that next step. Although having a new president will be an adjustment, the future of Columbus looks bright under a new leadership. For CCNN Live, I'm Christopher Gomez.